awesome animals. Hello everyone. Today we'll be traveling to Hungary and we'll be talking about the Visla. Please don't forget to smash that like button and subscribe to our channel for future weekly videos. Visla, the breed of sporting dog whose ancestors were probably brought to Hungary by the Magyars more than 1,000 years ago. The Visla can generally work both as a pointer and as a retriever. Developed on the open plains of Hungary, it was bred to be a swift and cautious hunter. The Visla is a multi-purpose dog that is suitable for work on upland game, on rabbits, and for waterfowl retrieving. The Visla is essentially pointer in type with characteristics of pointer and retriever. The Visla is also called a Hungarian pointer. This breed is described as lively, gentle, and affectionate, with above average learning ability and a strong desire to be with people who's known for being biddable. The Visla, which has a lifespan of 10 to 14 years, may suffer from hypothyroidism, dwarfism, persistent right arctic arch, tricuspid valve dysplasia, and progressive retinal atrophy. It is also prone to minor health concerns like lymphosarcoma and canine hip dysplasia, or major issues such as epilepsy. A male Visla is 22 to 24 inches at the shoulder. Females are smaller at 21 to 23 inches tall. Their bodies are muscular and well proportioned. Vislas generally mature at one or two years, although they reach their full size around six to eight months. There is a myth going around that Vislas don't shed. This seems to be a common misconception which can only have originated from people who don't own them. While Visla puppies don't shed too much, adult short-haired Vislas shed pretty much continuously. The hairs are usually quite short, so it isn't as noticeable as a longer haired dog. So the Visla is an ideal match for those with a sensitive nose and no desire to bathe their dog every week. Despite this, overall they are a low maintenance dog for grooming. A regular weekly brushing would most likely be apple for them. However, they will need their nails trimmed at least once every two months. If you hear them clipping on the ground, they are getting too long. Plus this will save you getting scratches when this bouncy breed jumps up to greet you. The Visla is a dog breed that originated in Hungary, a country in Eastern Europe. Its name literally translates from Hungarian to searcher or tracker, which is this dog's breed's main specialty. These dogs have excellent noses, which allow them to track down game. This has made them one of the most popular hunting dogs throughout its history. They are both excellent at pointing, finding game, and retrieving, which is bringing back game to the hunter. They are also considered to be a symbol of Hungary, along with the Commandor, a large Hungarian sheepdog, goulash, a typical Hungarian dish, and the typical Hungarian folk dance, among many other things. These dogs go back a long way as they were first mentioned in writing in a work referred to as the Illustrated Vienna Chronicle, or simply Chronicle and Pictum. This work was completed in the year 1357 on the order of King Louis I of Hungary himself. These dogs have been utilized as hunting dogs for many centuries, something that further developed their skills and instincts. Hungary, as most countries in Europe, has had a turbulent history. This includes the Turkish occupation 1526 to 1696, the Hungarian Revolution in 1848, World War I and World War II, all events which nearly resulted in the extinction of this breed. One of the most remarkable facts about Vislas is that their survival was literally hanged by a thread after World War II. A study conducted after the war concluded that only a dozen of pure Vislas were still alive, meaning most of the dogs we see today can all be traced back to these lucky survivors. Another critical moment happened in the 19th century when other breeds were introduced in the region and nearly replaced them. These breeds included English pointers and German short-haired pointers. Because of its increasing popularity and favorable character traits as a pet, the Visla has been used to create several other dog breeds. Some of these include the Weimaraner wire-haired Visla and German short-haired pointer. The American breed standard calls for the tail to be docked to two-thirds of its original length. Breed standards in countries where docking is banned, such as the UK, do not require this. The Visla holds its tail horizontally to the ground and wags it vigorously while charging through rough scrub and undergrowth. If you've enjoyed this video, please smash that like button and subscribe to our channel for future weekly videos. See you guys next time, goodbye!